So how to fix the PayPal Express checkout Shopify not working. So today I'm going to be showing you how to tackle the common issue many of in your face happens, which is the PayPal Express checkout not working on your Shopify store. So whether it's a problem with payments, not processing or customers unable to complete the purchases, these issues can affect your sales directly. So let's see what are the actual uh, fixing is stuffed. So first of all, verify your PayPal account. First, it's going to be really important to ensure that your PayPal account is properly set up and linked it into your Shopify store. So you might be seeing that you have here the Express PayPal Express checkout and here and to activate. If you already have this active, what I can suggest you is to deactivate it and try to activate it once more. Once you sign into your PayPal account, you should see that we have this signing up. It says now you have an account and you have successfully integrated PayPal with Shopify. So that is an actual check mark and I can go back directly into Shopify. Now let's focus into the Shopify integration. So go into Shopify Administrator Read Panel directly in Settings and go into Payments. If everything seems correctly here, once again, I told you uh, to deactivate and deactivate PayPal in the Shopify store. Sometimes reconnecting the service can resolve imminent issues. But this is not only as it is. If I see the PayPal to transaction fee that says active and I click in here and there's actually no issue here, what I need to do is to, of course, open any tab and go directly inside paypal.com. Directly here into paypal.com, what I'm going to do is to make sure that I don't have any banner, any notification, anything that appears in here into my actual PayPal account. Sometimes what happens into an actual PayPal account is that maybe you have something retained it, blocked it, or even, let's say, suspended for any reason. So once you make sure that everything has not been set correctly, directly from PayPal and directly from the actual Shopify, then what you want to do is to focus into the PayPal API credentials. So verify your PayPal API credentials. These are crucial for communication between the Shopify and the actual PayPal. So if there's a mismatch of error in your API username, your passcode or the signature, it will prevent the transaction from the process incorrectly. So you can regenerate these credentials from your PayPal account under APA address access and update them directly inside the Shopify or go directly into your profile settings. These are all my actual API logged in and security section. Even I have personal information, data and privacy and so much more. Once you have updated all of this, then what you can do is to go back into Shopify. Make sure, of course, that all your data and your privacy are up to date. Directly inside the search privacy, you want to update how people can find us into PayPal and review and edit people we previously blocked because sometimes there are a few uh, customers that we have blocked unexpectedly and they are the reason why we cannot accept other uh, actual comment payments directly from PayPal. And lastly, what you're going to do, of course, is to test your checkout process. So conduct a test transaction to pinpoint the actual issue. So add a product to your card and try to check that everything is out using PayPal. So watch for any errors here, uh, message that appears as this can give clues of what might be wrong. Common issue might include a redirect back to the card or without completing the purchase or whatever. So which could suggest a problem with the actual return URL settings directly into PayPal. So um, now guys, if you tried Consulting the Shopify and PayPal because if you try these steps and the problem actually still persists, it's time to contact the actual support. So what you want to do is to reach to the both Shopify and PayPal support team. So you can provide them directly with details of what you have tried, any error message received, and ask for further assistance. For Shopify, focus directly into the home section. Until the upper side, click into your actual store. Now focus into help center. And of course, what you want to do is to contact them directly or to try to look for the issue here from the self center. What I can tell you just do is to try to aim for an actual live support chat. And directly into PayPal, go into PayPal, look out for the actual help center. And once again, try to aim for a live chat so they can be helping us with the main issue and help it solve it automatically, guys. And sometimes the issue might stem from a larger technical problem or the end. So guys, there you actually have it. If you make sure that everything is correctly here into PayPal and both the Shopify, I believe that the best solution is to contact directly through them so they can be analyzing your account and figure out what is the actual main reason why you are not able to receive money 
directly from PayPal, guys. So there you have it. A few strategies to troubleshoot and fix issues with PayPal Express checkout on your Shopify store. Lastly, what I can show is just to just in case PayPal has no solution, is that what you can do is to try another third party payment provider. For example, if I have, for example, the PayPal, you can activate Shopify payments or to see other providers. For example, there's Bogus Getaway, there's CyberSource, there's Stripe, there's Money, and there's a lot of elements that you can choose depending on where's the actual country you're currently living. Sometimes there are more elements that are much more faster and less commissions rather than using PayPal, guys. So if you find this story helpful, guys, please like, share, and subscribe for more practical tips. Hopefully, with all that being said, we'll see you to a brand new section of Tech Express. See you next time.